Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about the differences between multiplication and division problems. Now, there's a couple of things to help you determine multiplication and division. Now, sometimes the multiplication symbol is going to be used, or they might use that of a dot. Or, if you see things like 3 times 5, no symbol at all, in that the numbers are just next to each other, tells you that it's a multiplication problem. They may also use the word product because product is a code word for multiplication. Now with division, they might use the division symbol. So visually, you might see numbers stacked on top of each other with a line in between, but a key word associated with division is that of quotient. So find the quotient of four and two, that means divide four and two. But at the end of the day, product and quotient, multiplication and division, are really related to each other because dividing is really another way of saying multiplying. For example, if you have 7 divided by 4, it can be written this way, but it can also be thought of as 7 times 1 quarter. So division is kind of is thought of as the inverse of multiplication. But there's a couple of things to distinguish the differences between the two, and I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's the differences between multiplication and division problems.